Hi guys, today's video is a little different. Because of quarantine, I am a changed person in so many ways, mentally and physically and just in my life. And quarantine kind of got me on this um, celebrity kick, I guess you could say. I have become more obsessed with Harry Styles over quarantine and that has caused me to make a lot of purchases. Yeah, because I was saving a lot of money before quarantine started and then my boredom in quarantine caused me to make a lot of purchases. So I'm going to give you a Harry Styles One Direction merch collection. Everybody has their one thing that they buy a lot of or love or like obsessed with or whatever and Harry is mine. So I'm going to show you guys everything that I own because of Sir Harry Styles. So we're gonna start out with clothes. I have not really planned for this so I have to go pick out my stuff right now. So I have um, a shirt or two that are in the wash still, but I can put in a picture of it. So we'll start off with his merch. I bought the um, stay safe, stay home, protect each other, whatever, COVID shirt from his store. This is size medium and I love this shirt and the proceeds went to COVID. So I loved that about it. Then I have the watermelon sugar shirt, which is being washed right now, but I also love that. And people said they thought it was ugly, but I actually really like it, so. And the last thing that's his merch is I have the gray Tribute with Kindness hoodie, and this is a size large because I wanted it oversized. And this is probably the best quality merch item that I've ever had in my life. Genuinely, it's Champions Champion hoodie, and it's so incredibly soft. These are from the Etsy shop Mario Kart. I have one more shirt, but it's also being washed. This first one is a bunch of skeletons, and it's like adore you. It says, oh honey, walk through fire for you, just let me adore you. This is in a size large. I love this. And then we have the Hit the Pedal Heavy Metal Rock Me One Direction shirt. This is a size extra large. And then I have the um, Heavy Metal One Direction black shirt, which is being washed. This I made myself in like January with my friend Maddie. We like DIY'd Harry merch. This is before I didn't have a Troopy with Kindness hoodie and I wanted one. So we like, you can barely even see, but it's like light blue with pink letters and it says Tribute with Kindness. And so I made myself a Tribute with Kindness hoodie. And then I made another one with another hoodie I got from Walmart and it's just like this picture from one of his photo shoots. So those are all of my hairy clothes. Let's move on to magazines. Okay, here are all my magazines and books. So we'll start out with One Direction because those are all like books. This is the Midnight Memories limited edition um, photo book, I guess. It comes with a CD. And it just, Midnight Memories and um, Made in the Am are my two favorite One Direction albums. I love Four, but like Midnight Memories and Made in the Am have special places in my heart. But I bought this off of Walmart's website. They have a bunch of like old One Direction stuff for a really good price. I'll show you a few hairy things that I got from there, but. And then I got this on Depop. It's a giant <laughs> One Direction book. It has so many pictures. This I bought one night when I was just like, I was watching This Is Us and I felt really inspired <laughs> to buy this because I listened to One Direction when I was younger, but like I wasn't a huge fan and I always felt like left out. Look, <laughs> I always felt like left out in that whole part and I really regret it, but I was a huge Selena Gomez and Zendaya. There's Zendaya right there. Zendaya fan, so I never really had a One Direction phase back then, but I have it now. I feel like a lot of other people are going through their One Direction phases now, but those are my One Direction books. Now we'll go to Harry Magazines. I got this from um, Barnes & Noble. It's just like a random Harry magazine. It came with posters. Then this was the first Harry magazine that I bought that's like a legit cover, and I love this shoot so much. It has like the Gucci on the back. This is probably one of my favorite shoots of his. I love it. This was a huge deal. I don't know if any, you're probably a fan if you're watching this. This was a big, like, this took so long to get here because it's from, uh, they did it in London, I think. I got this cover and I spent like 20 bucks on this and it's huge. I love this shoot and I think that we don't talk about it enough. It's just beautiful. This I got on Depop because I had been looking for the Rolling Stones magazine for so long and I, I got it for 45 bucks, which is, you might think it's insane, but people sell them for like $70, so somebody said 45 and 
I got it. I got this one recently. Those are all my books and magazines and things. So now let's go to like music. Let's start out with One Direction because that's smaller. I have the Where We Are DVD from San Siro, which is iconic as you know. I got this at Walmart. And then I got the Made in the AM CD on Depop. It was like discounted because I don't know if you can see that little like circle thing right here that's a little messed up. Okay, for Harry, I have Dunkirk on DVD. I've only watched Dunkirk once because these kind of movies aren't my thing, really. But he was really good at it, so. <laughs> for CDs, I think I have more of these coming, but I have two, because I ordered more tickets, and they said that they were gonna send me more. But I have two Fine Line CDs, and then I have one HS1 CD, which is beautiful. I got the book. I got this on Walmart for like 15 bucks, and they're being sold on Depop for like, 45 50 probably one of my favorite purchases because it's just so cute go to Walmart because I have pretty much everything and then I have both vinyls So I had this vinyl I got this from Urban Outfitters because it was the cheapest at the time This is what it looks like on the inside if you don't have it and then it comes with a big like booklet thingy That's the same thing as in the CD and I just I got the black vinyl because I couldn't find the white one But it's okay. And then I have this one this I got off of Harry's website. I got the black one I kind of wish I got the coke one or the splatter, but you know, I'm just thankful to have all of this. So that's all music, I think. This is in Harry One Direction, but I mean, it's Nile. But I just, I recently got these two CDs. I got these on Depop. I just felt like including these because this is my first like Nile merch and I'm very excited about it. I look crazy. I'm not crazy. <laughs> I'm just going through my phase a few years late and I really just could care less what you think, so. Now let's go into miscellaneous. Okay, we're gonna start out with candles. First ones that I got are the cashmere vanilla candles and I got the big ones. This one's like, I can't burn it anymore. This one I'm not burning ever because it's beautiful. If you saw this trend on TikTok or whatever this was, <laughs> like apparently it smells like him. Um, it smells like his Tom Ford cologne, which I later found out that it's not exactly like it. And this candle is the sweet tobacco candle. This is at Target and that candle's at Target, but I bought three of these. I love the scent and I know that these are gonna sell out now. It's just, it smells so nice. Like I just bought three because I wanted to and I had a gift card, so. Then I got the Nile candle. All of these candles, I love the scents anyway. It's the Vetiver Oak candle, also from Target. And then this was five bucks and this is the Louis candle. It's like, what's it called? Cozy Nights. I love the scent anyways, so again. Now let's move on to perfume. I have the One Direction perfume. I got this one on Amazon for like 20 bucks. And then literally today I was at Marshall's and I saw that they had it for 13. So I bought it and I'm not gonna open it. I have two nail polishes because of Perry. They're both from Etsy. These are the Bikini Sotini. He wore this to uh, the Brits. And then we have Mint Candy Apple because he said that this is like his go-to color. Mint Candy Apple was a big thing in like 2013. I had it in 2013, so, but this one I am wearing right now and it's shipping. I have his ring. Um, I got this from a store. I'll put it on the screen. And then I bought these glasses. These are like $3 from Target in the dollar section from the Watermelon Sugar Music video. And then I have this pearl necklace from Claire's because obviously, then I have this bag, it's Be Nice to Nice. It's like a tote bag, it's so cute. I bring it everywhere from the Shop Press Paper Shop. It's Etsy. Okay, last two things. <laughs> My friend Grace gave me this One Direction folder and I just think it's the funniest thing. She found it in her basement and shout out to you, Grace, thank you. <laughs> last thing, I have the My Policeman book because I wanted to read it ever since he started talking about it and then there's a rumor that he's going to star in the movie with Lily James. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna read it. And I started it and I love it so far. That is everything. I hope you enjoyed my insaneness and found it funny or interesting. This is what I'm happy with. This is what makes me happy. Music is the one of the only things that brings me joy. I also just wanted to add that the amount of merch that you have does not make you a bigger or better fan of an artist and that Harry makes me happy. And having this stuff, even though it's like material things, it just brings me a lot of joy. And in a time like this where the world is not very joyful, these are the little things that make me happy, so. That's it. <laughs> this is a very different video for me. Let me know if you like these kinds of videos because I can make more hairy videos if you want me to. I'll see you guys next time I upload. Stay safe, wear a mask. <laughs>